people have told each other stories since before recorded history. Cave paintings, epic ballads, songs, art, and the written word have all been methods for storytelling in our past. During the 19th century, photography was invented. At first, photographs were expensive and required long exposure times, so scenery and portraits were the only viable uses. By the turn of the 20th century, photography had developed to the point that motion pictures could be created. 20th century developments in cinema technology allowed motion picture photography to become a leading form of storytelling, leading to television and the modern digital cinema. As photographic technology developed, personal cameras became available to households, and regular people could record moments of their own lives. With anybody now able to tell stories about their lives with pictures, photo albums and slideshows became ways to recall past events and people. This still required the people hearing the story to be together in the room with the storyteller. Photography's move from analog to digital quickly changed how people thought of photos. Digital cameras make taking, selecting, editing and printing photographs much faster, cheaper, and easier. The spread of the World Wide Web and popularity of social media sites such as Facebook and Flickr have made digital photography even more powerful. Now, we can all tell our stories to anybody with Internet access through the photographs we take of our daily lives. Digitization of photography has made sharing photos cheaper and easier, but these days it is not always cameras which we use to capture photos. The convergence of a number of different technologies has changed how we think about photography. Now, mobile phones are the primary camera for a lot of people. With camera phones, people are likely to be able to take photos of newsworthy events as they occur, like terrorist acts or the London riots. Where before, we had to wait for news stories to be filtered to. Us through the mass media, we can now be participatory journalists, sharing our society's stories with each other, regardless of time and place. Taking a photograph, having it developed, and sharing it with others, used to take days. With digitization and convergence, we can now take a photograph on a device such as a mobile phone, upload it directly to a social media site, and share it with people around the world in under a minute. We're often no longer in the room with the people we tell our stories, but storytelling through photography is just as important as it ever has been. Whether this is for families, for news events, or for enjoyment, the human contact may no longer be close physically, but it is just as close emotionally.